Welcome to my Science Behind Pixar walking tour of the exhibit found at the California Science Center in Los Angeles, California. What you're seeing now are the posters located out the entrance line to the exhibit. These posters provide fun facts about the Pixar animation process. Now, when you first enter the exhibit, you walk into a theater where there's a five minute video that introduces you to the Pixar facilities and some of the staff. I did not record any of this video and I'm sorry, but some things I do believe are sacred to the exhibit. However, you will get a taste of the exhibit as I walk out of the theater doors and into the glorious 40 workstations and interactive zones of Pixar movie magic fun. So here's the beginning of the exhibit. We start with rigging and you have these little workstations that you can play with and there's computers set on both the front and back that have the exact same setup. So there's never a moment that you get stuck behind another family waiting for your turn to have fun playing with whatever the setup is. Now, as we go through this exhibit, I did not film every single workstation and every single how-to video. Again, some things should be sacred to the exhibit. But for those of you that can't make it to Los Angeles, I hope you at least enjoy or learn something from this little video. However, if you can make it, you have from now until October 9th, 2017 to check this out. And trust me, it's worth the price of admission. Now, each workstation had photo setups with additional fun facts, like the one pictured here. And in every station, you had an opportunity to experience hands-on various stages of the animation process. Here, I'm trying to make Woody wave his arm, which we can see uh, the motion range and everything else. Also uh, in the exhibit are tons of places for photo ops and just a lot of other Disney magic. This is a lot of fun. You take fabric from your choice that was available and put it onto this 3D model and see how the model, one shape can, you know, it became a piece of cheese and then it became a slice of watermelon. What you're not seeing is that there's air sucking the fabric in. So as you place it, that's what made it stick to the model so quickly. Here's the WALL-E photo op. So much fun. And you also got to play with camera focus and camera angles and all of that basics that you would have in normal movie magic, but it is also equally as important in animation. And of course, my photo op with Wally. Another fun camera station was this one where you could actually get a bug's eye view of what it would look like to look between the blades of grass and up at a tree. You can move the camera up and to the side. Just a lot of fun. Of course, you could also meet Dory. That was another great photo op. And there was tons of other interactive things from sculpting by numbers, where you take a 3D model on a computer screen and you pinpoint the spots yourself and make your own model, and then you can rotate it in three dimensions. And there was uh, actual created Pixar models that you could look at as well like these. My favorite Pixar film is Ratatouille. If you're watching this, leave me a comment. Let me know what your favorite Pixar film is. But as you can see, the workstations were plenty, and it was not very crowded, and it was an overall fun exhibit. Now, as you walk out the doors of this exhibit, there is one final part that I did not record, which just shows the rendering process in the animation, and then there's a little gift shop. Once again, I highly recommend this experience. Thanks for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed. See you next time.